Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Portal 2. And today, I am back at the uh, the bottom of this uh, huge pit that I fell down last episode. Uh, if you didn't see it, it was uh, pretty crazy. Uh, our friend Weebly, who's been uh, trying to help us escape, has apparently turned evil and now has control of the entire facility and turned uh, the GLaDOS computer into a potato. So now we're stuck. I don't really know where we're at. We're kind of like underneath like the lab, it looks like. So let's go this way. This is kind of the only way I can go. Uh, I guess we're going in this direction. I still have my portal gun, which is good. So I can put portals down. There's not really anywhere I could put them though. Doesn't look like there's any walls. There's a lot of, like, scaffolding and stuff around here. Oh, I can put a portal here. Let's see. Is there somewhere I can put another one at to where I can get out of here? All right, so I can actually put a portal over on that side. So let's see if I can get out of here. Uh, how does that help? I'm now on this side. Oh, can I go up there? All right, I can put a portal there. I'm slowly making my way out. So, where do I go next? Alright, so it looks like there might be, like, some sort of exit over there. It says, do not enter. But I'm thinking that might be where we need to head. So, let's follow this path here. Keep out. Do not enter. They really do not want me to go in here. Uh, can I go through this door? That doesn't work. Does this door work? Nope. Can I put a portal? I'm pretty sure I gotta get in here somehow. This has gotta be the uh, the next place I gotta go. Because I can put a portal here. But I don't know if I can put one on the other side. Can I put one up? Oh, I can put one up there. Okay. So we're now on the other side of the wall. Uh, I guess I can go down there. Alright, so we've got a switch. Pull lever. Oh, great. Um, oh, that's a big door. At least the, uh, the power still works. So, can we go up there? I guess. Let's see if I can make my way up to that room. If I go ahead and head through this portal. There we go. So, we got a button here. Um, oh, great, the timer. I gotta get over to the other side, I think. So I can put a portal there, and then push this. Oh, how do I get through? Quick, push the other one. Did I get it? I don't think I got it in time. All right, let's go back. Oh, right, you gotta do this like really fast. Wait, I think I know how to do this. You gotta put a portal here, and then run over this way. There we go. Uh, I guess it's opening the hatch. What is behind this huge door? Oh, great. Uh, we're, oh, it's gonna go up. Okay, cool. What's behind the big door? Do I go in? I guess I go in. Oh, wait, there's no, it's just a solid wall? Oh, wait, no, there's a, a little door behind the big door. What is this? Open door. Okay. That's interesting. So let's see where we're at now. Uh, what is this? Danger. Uh, that's not good. There's wires dangling from above. Oh, right. So... What is that? There's like these huge balls in the air. I don't know what that is. I'm guessing I have to get somehow up there. Uh, is there a way I can put a portal down somewhere? I can put one on that wall. Can I put one somewhere else? Okay, so I think I figured out how to get out of here. This door has been busted open and I can actually put a portal here. So I think this is the next place that I'm supposed to go. Oh, pull lever. There we go. Uh, oh, 
perfect. The door opens. Alright, so I guess we're at like the entrance of Aperture Science apparently. The sign kind of fell apart. Uh, I'm not really sure where they go next. I guess maybe down that way. Oh, there's a area up there. Can I walk across that? I might be able to get up there. Alright, so I think where I'm supposed to go next is up in that room there. Because that says enter. So I'm assuming I have to get up there. Alright, so I think I figured out uh, how to get into the door. I gotta put a portal up there. Go through here. Uh, not fall off. And then put a portal right there. And that should launch me over there. So let's drop down from here. Go through the blue portal. Through the hole. And we're here. Yes, the door opens. Every day here in our enrichment spheres. I can't personally oversee every one of them, so these pre recorded messages will cover any questions you might have and respond to any incidents that may occur in the course of your science adventure. Your test assignment will vary depending on the manner in which you have bent the world to your will. Those of you helping us test the repulsion gel today, just follow the blue line on the floor. Those of you who volunteered to be injected with praying mantis DNA, I've got some good news and some bad news. Bad news is we're postponing those tests indefinitely. Good news is we've got a much better test for you. Fighting an army of Mantis men. Pick up a rifle and follow the yellow line. You'll know when the test starts. Oh. Well, that's fun. Uh, i rather follow the blue line. Uh, how do I get over to the blue line? Can I go over there? Nope, can't go that way. I can definitely put a portal there. Oh, over there. Alright, so I think what I might have to do is I, I might have to launch over to there. So if I put a portal there, that will launch me up and over. But to do that, I need to land on something. Oh, can I? Yes, I can put a portal on that. Alright, so what I need to do is go through... I guess I could put a portal here. Then put that one back over there. Drop through this one. Now, where is that one spot that I could drop onto? Oh, yeah, there it is. Alright, so let's drop down here. And that will hopefully launch me over to the platform. There we go. Barely made it. So, what is this? This is Pump Station Alpha, apparently. This is apparently the gel pressure controls. Cool, let's turn that on. Uh... Okay. Well, stuff is moving. That's great. Uh, it's good to know that, uh, everything still works down here. Okay, so... Ow! All right, let's get started. That is this bright. something the lab boys call repulsion gel. You're not part of the control group, by the way. You get the gel. Last poor son of a gun got blue paint. <laughs> All joking aside, that did happen. Broke every bone in his legs. Tragic, but informative. Or so I'm told. Okay. Well, I was looking at uh, this thing over here. Apparently, there's like a bunch of different like testing spheres. So that's what all those different balls were that I saw floating in the air. So each one of these, I guess, is like a test. This is number nine. And we gotta make our way all the way to the top. Oh, this will be interesting. Alright, so here's the uh the gel. What does this stuff do? Oh, it's bouncy. That's cool. Um, where are we supposed to go? I guess up to the top. Uh, can I bounce higher if I keep bouncing on it? 
It doesn't stay in the bounce. Oh, hold control uh, to prevent bouncing. Okay. That's cool. Uh, oh, I can put a portal down there. So let's go up this way. And we got a button. What does that do? Oh, it activates the exit. So I think I need to get a box out of there. Uh, there is a button over there that I can hit, but I have to get on the other side. So let's see if I can bounce this way. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. So that'll get a box. Cool. All right, so let's grab this uh, box here and bring this over to the other side. All right, so now I can put this on the button and then I can just bounce over here. All right, so the next thing that I need to do is head up to the top. But to do that, I need a place to put another portal right here. Perfect. So where do I go next? All right, so I can actually drop down onto this platform. Um, let's see if I can get on this platform because I need to go over there and get that box. So as soon as this comes back, I can drop down onto the platform. Perfect. All right, let's go get this box here. And somehow I need to get up there, which I should be able to just put a portal down and then go through this one and put this on the button, which, uh, oh, it activates that. So now I can launch myself across here. How am I supposed to do that? Oh, it just allows me to jump higher. Cool. So what does this do? Oh, that moves that platform apparently, but I need to get a box. Oh, right, I don't want to fall down there. That would not be good. Wait, can you run on that? Can you do like wall running? Let's see if this works. Oh, no, it just bounces you back and forth. That's pretty cool. And we made it. Nope, stop, stop. Okay, there we go. All right, let's get the, uh, the box and then bounce our way back this way. This is definitely uh, a really cool puzzle. Now, how do I stop? Oh, there we go. So now that I've got that, I can put a portal there and I should be able to just drop down from here and then I can go up to the top. Perfect. Oh, in case you got covered in that repulsion gel, here's some advice the lab boys gave me. Do not get covered in the repulsion gel. We haven't entirely nailed down what element it is yet, but I'll tell you this, it's a lively one and it does not like the human skeleton. Oh, oh, that that's great to know. Just don't get the gel on you. Okay, so I think this is going to be the uh, the final uh, test chamber for today. Uh, looks like I got to get somehow up there as the exit. This is, I think, falling apart. I don't think it's originally supposed to look like this. Do not lean on the railing. Well, that's not going to happen. Uh, let's see where I can go because I can drop down from here. But I need to get... Oh, can I go up there? Yeah, I can go up there. Alright, let's go through this portal. And now... Oh, there we go. I can go in that room. So if I jump through here... Okay, so... That apparently turns on the goo. Now, can I turn it off? Because I do not want to get hit by that because like they said you do not want to get covered in the goo uh where do i go next i have no idea wait can i put a portal there oh oh that's cool so i can just put goo wherever i want that's nice so let's see i don't want to stop bouncing i want to go up there so let's see if i can bounce oh that's cool, so it's going to keep putting it down there. Uh, where do I go next? I can put some over on that surface there. There we go. So that'll put goo down there. Alright, let's just see what happens if I go up here. Because I can launch into this room. And then put a portal there. Oh yeah, I can just put another one down right there. Alright, so that will put uh, the gel over there. 
Uh, I'm not really sure exactly how that helps just yet. I might be able to launch... If I put a portal here, I might be able to launch over this way. Yeah, and then I can bounce off of that. And that's it. There's a slight chance the calcium could harden and vitrify your frontal lobe. Anyway, don't stress yourself thinking about it. I'm serious. Visualizing the scenario while under stress actually triggers the reaction. Alright, so here we are on the, uh, the next test here. Uh, I think this is where I'm going to start next now, episode. if you're part of control group Kepler-7, we implanted a tiny microchip about the size of a postcard into your skull. Most likely you've forgotten it's even there. But if it starts vibrating and beeping during this next test, let us know. Because that means it's about to hit 500 degrees, so we're going to need to go ahead and get that out of you pretty fast. Oh, that that's great to know. Uh, but I think this is going to be a good time to uh, end this episode here. Next episode, I'll go ahead and continue. I don't know what this stuff is. Is this like water? I have no idea. There's all kinds of weird gel that we have to mess with now. So that's going to be it for today. So I'm going to go ahead and end the episode here. So make sure to leave a like and to subscribe. Thanks for watching and I will see you next time. Goodbye everybody.